Hey everybody, meteorologist Daniel Grant here with your Denver Gazette forecast. Uh, today, get ready, we are tracking more snow moving in later this afternoon. In fact, we might even find a quick round of rain before it transitions over to snow this afternoon by about two, three o'clock. Temperatures a lot cooler than yesterday when we were basking in the 60s and the winds they will start to pick up because of a cold front that is pushed in across the state. 40s lining up the I-25 corridor for this afternoon's highs. 30s around Nederland up to Winter Park, Idaho Springs. The storm system packing a good punch up in the high country, delivering some nice snowfall for skiers and snowboarders for the second half of the weekend. Some fresh powder out there here in the metro area will be capitalizing on some of that later tonight. As we look at the future cast, this takes us to 8 a.m. this morning. Still dry, still quiet here for eastern Colorado. A little lull in the action up in the mountains, but then by about 3, 4 o'clock, we'll be monitoring that moisture moving in here to the metro area. Up and down I-25, we're talking rain, but again, it doesn't last long. By about 6, 37 o'clock, we're looking at snow here for the city. That continues until about 11 o'clock or so tomorrow, this evening, and then it continues into tomorrow morning. So I anticipate seeing the Monday morning drive pretty tricky out there. This is about eight o'clock when it's still snowing out to the west. The eastern plains also capitalizing on a little bit of this snow. We do have travel alerts out there. The winter storm warning in red. The watch here for Denver that stretches south toward the Palmer Divide, Sangre de Cristos, the Wet Mountains, and then across the Gore and Elk Mountains. An advisory for four to eight inches here in the heart of the city. I'm anticipating about two to five inches. You live to the north. Really, the storm isn't for you. Further to the south toward Castle Rock Highlands Ranch. That's where we'll see some amount it's closer to about half a foot to upwards of a foot in and around the foothills. Your seven day forecast showing more snow. Once the system moves out on Monday afternoon, we'll get a brief lull before this next one rolls in Tuesday afternoon into Wednesday. It keeps us cool. We'll get a quick little warm up on Thursday before another storm rolls in just in time for next weekend.